Hello and welcome back to Naturally Miss Chris. Today I'm sharing with you all how I revert my hair from straight to curly. And I know some of you all might be thinking, sure, just go and wash your hair. But some of us cannot do that. If I was to do that, my hair would be extremely tangled. And the goal here is to avoid as much breakage as possible. So I am going to be starting with a hot oil treatment which is going to bring back some of the moisture that may have been lost. And I'm using um, the Strength and Restore oil from K-Curls Collection, but you can use any oils that works for your hair or that you have on hand. Y'all, I flat ironed my hair the day before Mother's Day. So it's been what, two and a half weeks. And I've only gotten the chance to wear my hair straight for three days because I ended up getting sick when well, my son ended up getting sick first and I ended up catching whatever what he had and I neglected my hair and it's it was just a waste of time I couldn't find my plastic cap, so I went ahead and used a Walmart grocery bag. So shout out to Walmart for that because they are always coming in handy. Oh, and another thing I wanted to say, make sure that when you're doing your hot oil treatment, that your oil is not too hot when you put it on your scalp because you can really damage your scalp like that. I ended up outside doing my hair because my baby wanted to go outside and play and We've been getting a lot of rain lately, and they hadn't really been having any chance to play outside, so I was like, okay, let's just go outside. Okay, so now I'm following up with Africa's Best Hair Mail. I love this stuff. I cannot do without it. Even though I have my own products, this is something that I just, I have to have on hand at all times. It's a very good protein treatment. It has different herbs. It has olive oil, eggs. It's just bomb all around. Straightening your hair makes your hair more fragile. So by using this protein treatment, or any protein treatment, um, it helps to restore balance and it helps to strengthen my strands. And if there are any heat damage or whatever, it could possibly help in reverting it, which I do have heat damage, but it's from a previous flat iron. You would think I would learn my lesson by now, but anyway, it helps to nourish and soften hair and it helps to prevent breakage. And like I said before, that's the goal. And it makes my hair very easy to detangle. Like I said before, I can't just go straight in the, sh the shower or whatever and just wash my hair after it's flat iron because it tangles up and it's, oof, it's a headache. So these are the steps that I follow.
notice that I am um, sectioning off my hair instead of just going in and applying the protein treatment and that's because I want to make sure that um, all my strands have a chance of getting that protein.
it amazes me how much my hair texture has changed throughout the years. Um, I used to have a tighter curl pattern, but it's like the longer my hair gets, the looser my curl pattern becomes. It's just, it's crazy. As you all can see, I have maybe four strings that has heat damage. My intention was to leave the protein treatment in my hair for 30, 30 to 45 minutes, but it ended up being five hours. I followed up with using k Curls Collection Shampoo and Conditioner, and I finished it off using k Curls Collection's Extra Hole Curl Pudding. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And while you're down there, go ahead and click that subscribe button and a notification bell so you can be informed every time I upload. And I will see you all in my next video. See ya!